Hey everybody, been a while, hasn't it? So, this is the Dark Comic Nerd Guys, and we are here playing Fate Grand Order. Um, I'm sorry to all those new subscribers that subscribe to my Shattered Ray Shift channel, guys, and when we kind of drop the ball. Um, if we do good with some of the summoning tonight, we'll actually put this on both channels, guys. Um, so, if we get lucky, shout out to all my... my quite a few subscribers guys i i don't i haven't checked in a day or two but we might no nah, i doubt we're at 300 but we might be much closer um and so the thing is is that um at this point um oh, what was i thinking about yeah um we'll see how tonight turns out guys and then we'll uh determine if we're going to Go ahead and actually put this up on the Dark Comic Nerd channel and on Shattered Ray Shift, guys. But uh, let's see what happens. Uh, if anybody remembers the last episode, which, once again, sometimes they get posted on Dark Comic Nerd. Sometimes they only get put on Shattered Ray Shift. So if you do not know what I'm referring to, it means you might have to go to the other channel to see what happened. Yup, yup. But um, I did mention that we were having a summoning campaign. We actually have quite a few guys there's this part two of chapter four memorial which is uh i believe um it has to do with some of the lost belt skies um and so they're redoing all the some of the, well not all but a good majority of the characters that were prominent during some of the lost belt campaigns um then this is from the fgo waltz uh collaboration guys which i got to give you guys an update on that um here's another one that came out Here's another one, here's another one, and there we go, guys, and that's what they've got going on. Now, unfortunately, the next event is something that I don't take too kindly to, guys. It's going to be um, this stupid Grail Front Super Camelot thing. I don't take kindly to any of the Grail Fronts, guys. They are, they were long, and they are frustrating, and they suck up a lot of my time. I do not have the time to sit there and do these things. Now, they are coming up with these awesome little um, uh, craft essence guys for them. This is what they're going to do. Nothing too much, but it's always nice to see that they kind of form one big, long picture. Um, there is also a campaign coming out, guys, as far as the summoning campaign, um, where they're going to be doing these characters up the top, guys, that you're looking at. I have all those five stars. Uh, ironically, they're the same characters that are from the um or at least they showed more prominently during the sixth was it sixth singularity no the fifth i think which is the camelot one because i think the sixth one well it either had to be the sixth or the fifth guys i'm trying to remember no it had to be the sixth it had to be because the seventh singularity was where they were in uruk and it was that that's the one i keep thinking the seventh singularity was the final one but no the final one was actually listed as the final singularity i don't think they actually gave it a number um but i do not like um grail fronts they do not they take way too long one time i did one for half an hour just to get blown out of the water and it was just i i don't i don't need to do these for for grails i don't i have tons and tons of grails i am set i am good so you guys will probably not be seeing me do anything about that. Now there's only two days left of the event, guys, here. I have already completed everything going on with um, uh, with this event, guys. Uh, the only problem I have right now is, is that um, I currently... Uh, let me double check, guys, and see if I can show you. Yeah? Okay. So... Um, let's take one for example here. Stardust in the palm. I'm still working on trying to get her up high enough. Because I found out as you went along, guys, you had to have the character at full ascension and max level. What a pain in the butt. That was dumb. I really think that they, they shafted a lot of players that were new with that. That is dumb. Um, but we have, uh... What is it? Altera. Um, who else are we missing? We have... Um, Helena here, guys. Which is right here. That's so... Manaha. Um, I know I'm saying it wrong, but I don't care. Um, I'm going to go choose Servant. 
Um, we are also missing for right here, Prove. I mean, it says Prove, but I'm thinking that. Well, I don't know. Actually, it might be. It might be called Prove. It might be so simple, but um, it just seems weird. Um, so I just called it something where I'm wondering if it's supposed to be more French or more of an accent. Um, that is possibly our last one, too. Yeah, so we only had three. We did, um, we did a bunch, guys. We did Nero here. Um, we did, uh, what's your name? Uh, Ural. Uh, which I'm not sure I'm pronouncing some of the names right, guys. I'm just doing my best. Um, Ushuakamaru. Um, we got uh, Netocris or Nidocris. Um, uh, let's see. Hassan of the Serenity. Um, Tamomo Cat. And uh, Mash got one automatically, and that was easy because almost everybody by this point in the game, unless you're a new player, has Mash already up to 80, and it's it's very very easy. So um, I want to check something. Yeah, I thought so. A lot of clothes from summer events. Um, so what we're gonna do, guys, is we are going to do. Um, I don't think we're gonna. Cr now that we're done. I think I might wait for a last day thing with Crane. I really want to get her as a servant, especially because who knows when she might show up again because she was really out of the limited to this. Though it's a good possibility they might redo the event as a as a an RE event next year, so we could end up with all kinds of opportunities to try to get her again by next year. Um, I will do. I want to get doing some summoning here, guys. Take our chances to try to get Meb. That's what we're here for. Um, so we're going to try to get some stuff in here. Do I have, I only have writers and I wanted to keep that. So this is going to be dicey. We might actually not do much of a, um, uh, what am I thinking of? Pre, um, pre warm up type stuff, guys. We might not do much. There's no guarantee we're going to get super great. Though I have been doing pretty good tonight. Um, can't say I've been doing spectacular. So, yeah, we'll just use something we have there. And there we go. Something Miss said about when you can see the predictive line there, guys. Um, if it's below half, it seems like the game has more likelihood to give you the rest. So, but that's all we needed, guys. We wanted to do that, and we're going to try for Meb. That's why I'm keeping so many of my Rider. Uh, Hellfire Wisdoms, because we want that in case we get her. Let's hope, guys. She's one of very few servants I do not have, it seems like. Um, and she's been very elusive. She's been kind of sucking it a bit too bad. Um, it would... Oh, well, there you go. Four star right off the bat. It's too bad, because we're unfortunately probably likely to get some Nero's drops in our lap, uh, or poop or something, but... Wow, of all the five stars to get, I haven't seen that one in a while. But once again, it looks like we're losing the coin flips. That was happening a lot last time. Whoa, what a parade of gold. Two four stars and a five star, but all CE, so not good for me. Saw some pause there. Fortunately, everything is CE. Well, I did need some more of that. There is the five stars event CE. My gosh, look at the amount of... I don't know what to be more surprised at, guys. The amount of CE we're getting. Ooh, that looked like a good pause. We're going to get a servant finally. Finally. I was going to say, it was, it was coming down to... I didn't know what to be more shocked by. The amount of CE or the more that we're getting plenty of gold. We already have two five star CE just in this one roll and it's still going so that gave us two chances because I still have the belief that the algorithm says we're going to flip a coin and see if you get a five star servant or a five star um, CE 
So we had two chances, and basically both chances came up as screw you. So lovely. Just lovely. suppose we could go for third times the charm, but we're not even lucky enough so far to get a four-star serving. That's the right class we're looking for, too. What a shame. What a nutty turn of events, guys. That was crazy. And that particular CE we got right here, guys, um, is going to lead us to a very interesting situation that we're going to take a look at. And we are going to take a look at some other stuff in between and everything, guys. Um... Okay, we need to go to... Let's do where we're going to take a look, guys, at the event. I want to just show everybody. Um, there we go, guys. We have completed everything. All we have is the super, super difficult, high-difficulty five-star idol thing here. I don't really care much for that. Um, however, this is what I kept trying to think, what I want to show you guys. So, if we go over here to vocal, a few more, and I'll be able to get another CE. Uh, and then after that, there's not much else. I've already picked up a lot of the other good stuff. It's just bonus stuff pretty much from here. Um, in this one, guys, I can try to get this next Spiritron dress wardrobe ticket, but it ain't worth nothing because I, I, I can't do much with it. Not with, the, the, not with the restrictions they put on it. Now, I want to talk a little bit more after, guys. Here's another one. I'm almost there to get that. I really just want to get the rest of that, um, the rest of the CDs, guys, so that I can try to uh, possibly blend them together maybe at the end, though. I would probably keep them separate on the off chance that they're going to do a repeat of the event. I'm going to look it up um, and see if they did it in Japan, and that will tell me if they're going to do it, because this is about the time I thought I heard rumors that they stopped doing repeat events in Japan, so I wonder. Um... At the same time, what did we want to look at, guys? Uh, crap. I know there was something we want to look at. Oh, what was it? Sorry, guys. My apologies. I got so much going on in my head tonight. It's hard to keep track. Just to show you guys what we've already collected, let's look at all this stuff. There's all the, there's all the items, we got all her guitars to keep ascending her. We got tons of stuff. Oh, do we have more? Um, I haven't picked up all that. No, I haven't picked up enough to get more of the pieces, unfortunately. Because, man, they, the highest level thing, guys, once again, the highest level item, which is these quartz pen lights. I have been getting them hand over fist, and it's been crazy, but I really have nothing to use them on. It's nuts. It's absolutely nuts. Um, in a second, guys, if I can't remember the other thing I was going to show you, um, we might pause while I get my brain in here. But I did want to show you guys for the event. We're really all set. Um, it was a fun event. I highly recommend it if you guys can, you know... Uh, play the event. I, I think you can be a beginner and be fine with that. There's a couple of things I'm curious about that I uh, haven't come to light yet. Um, okay. Uh, like I said, guys, my brain is kind of scattered tonight. It is uh, quarter past two in the morning, so I guess it's uh, to be expected. Um, but yeah, I'm going to switch from an, I'm going to switch to all. And then I am going to quickly look, guys, at that newest CE we got. Man, I have ridiculous amounts of certain five stars that just drive me nuts. Um, here's one I didn't remember to blend together, guys. I'm going to take care of that real quick. If we're lucky enough that we actually get a super or great success from it, we'll jump right into the summoning. That was almost eerie. And they're giving them away tonight pretty much, too. That's our second one, guys. That was a little too easy, but considering how the last one turned out, what the hey, we'll just go for it and shoot. And I don't know how many summons I'm going to do tonight, guys. That is up in the air. 
Well, we could use some more of those. And yes, I do not have the camera on tonight, guys, uh, because frankly, uh, it just takes up too much of my screen. Um, it's one thing I do miss about my old tablet. So I've gotten to the point where I, I said, you guys don't really want to look at my ugly mug. If we ever got a lot of viewers here looking at this stuff, I think otherwise. And I do um, oh, a lot of riders tonight. I'm very happy about that. So maybe we'll get the Meb one finally. Um, she is another one that you can get a um, spiritual dress for. But we'll, we don't have her. So um, I think I will show you guys something else about the dress shop. Where they are going to have a special thing soon. So you can pick up all kinds of, um, man, a lot of riders, but not the one we want. Uh, all kinds of wonderful Spiritron dresses. Um, you can pick them up, guys, I think after the event is over. I have a theory there's going to be one in particular I want to go after. Wow! What a lot of riders, and they're all different ones. Would it be nice to get something really good? Hint, hint, game. Woo! It's going to be a guaranteed 5-star with the Rainbow Ring. So it's either going to be Meb or... Is it going to be Meb? Yeah, baby! Woo! All right. So this one's going up. Shout out to the Dark Comic Nerd crew. This baby is going up on both sites tonight. Yeehaw! Oh, that worked out really well. Thank you, Lord. It's been a very extremely stressful day. With work, I needed that pick-me-up. That was fantastic. And to see the rainbow rings. I have been so long without seeing the rainbow rings. So I sometimes think that you see the rainbow rings only with some of the original five stars. And Meb has been around for a very long time. So it makes sense that um, she would show up with the rainbow rings. And I think it tends to show up a lot more with five-star characters that you don't really have that are rated up during the banner that you are summoning on. So I think if it fulfills a couple conditions, we're good. Now let's listen up, guys. All right, take a look at what her stats are, guys. Golden rule, apply debuff immune and restore HP and increase NP gauge each turn. That is awesome. Golden rule is always a great one. Charisma is the typical, you increase your um, attack usually for all allies too. And Siren Song is what it looks like, guys. It is a charm effect. And if I remember correctly, it also, um, I think, decreases defense or decreases. It's a, got a, another debuff with it other than just the charm, which is basically like a stun effect. Um, and I think it only can target somebody of the opposite gender. And I think it's only one person, unlike with some of them, where they can actually hit everybody. So there's the Idle Radiance, guys, for this event. Next to that, she doesn't have a lot of passive skills. Chariot, my love, pretty simple. Deals significant special attack damage to a single male enemy. If it's not male, it just doesn't have that extra bump to its attack strength. Attack damage increases with, um, yeah, we always know it. Uh, you know, special attack damage increases with overcharge. That, that's nothing unusual. Uh, decreased mental debuff resist. Um, for a single enemy and basically what that really is guys is it means that um, If her charm effect isn't that charm skill isn't working really well on us on another person It means it just is more likely to work now. That's basically a fancy way of what that's really doing um, Yeah, she was kind of a let's just put it this way. She was kind of a hoe so <laughs> Sorry, it's just the way it is um, luck EX and NPA plus next to that uh, the only other thing that looks good is her agility because she's a woman and because probably her Numerous escapades if you catch my drift. She probably has a bit more flexibility now She has multiple costumes guys. And we're gonna take a quick look at those in a second and I'll show you guys that that character is going to come with a plethora of uh, things that now will give me an opportunity to get a bunch of new costumes for her. Now, um, some of which weren't available to me yet, but they will be down the road. Bewitching Prison Warden, that was something that just came up recently. If anybody has been watching my channel for uh, the last couple months, we did manage to get that. And then Hero My Love, here it is, guys. Uh, 
pretty simple little dress, I find. Uh, I don't know if you guys can get a good look at that, but there we go. Unfortunately, since we just got the character and there's only two more days left to get the, um, uh, to be able to get her to max ascension, I do not see it happening, though I'm going to do my best. Um, I want to show you guys one more thing, though. I meant to do that before I backed out. Um, if you guys look right here, you'll see that you can use regular items in the background if you don't have a ticket to get rid of this. Now, tickets will be pretty much useless, I get the impression, with afterward, but we will have plenty of the items to do it when we do finally get her up to Final Ascension and stuff. Now, it won't mean much, but it is what it is. Okay, let's get out of the talkie girl. And, um... Okay, guys. So, um... We have one last thing. You can imagine who it is. It's Miss Crane. We're doing pretty good tonight. We will take an extra shot at seeing if we can get Miss Crane. But if we cannot get Miss Crane, I am not going to drive myself crazy trying to look for her. Um, right here, guys. Here it is, dressmaking. It's not going to pop up until after the event is over. So we still got a couple more days left. But let's see, guys. We did not even really do what we wanted to do, which was... We wanted to get over here, guys, and we wanted to see about a certain five-star. And we're going to try to see if we can find it and see, did it need, what is it available to be blended? Then I will have to deal with all this other stuff later, guys. Oh, check this out, guys. We did get the final one we need for right here for this card that will be great that will bolster our craft essence really well guys we're gonna do that i don't know what's gonna happen not after what happened to the last one we got caught off guard on that one so let's uh multi lock guys we don't do the five stars very often i admit okay guys let's see what we end up with we don't do these ones very often with the five stars they are precious and that we did not get as much out, but let's see, is it going to be 30%? Yes, increase your art card effectiveness 30%. So whenever we get these ones that are already 25%, guys, they're going to max out at 30%. Uh, if you guys remember from the previous video, we had talked about... Um, no, go away, go away, go away. Uh, we had talked about um, the one of the ones that increased your buster card effectiveness 25%, so you can imagine. Um... Are we still looking at just five stars? I want to say I think we are, guys. What's bugging the crap out of me is I'm not seeing the card in question, which is I highly, highly unusual. Is it up here? It's the one with Jean d'Arc looking at the mirror, and I know it's a five star, so where are you? Um, I'm thinking there's not too many copies that I have, but... Oh, and there it is, guys. So that is right there. That is going to be the start of another one for us. So, wow. A lot of stuff to dump into the archive. Um, we're going to now go and do Meb, guys, real quick. No matter what happens, we will just take what we can. We're going to go with one shot on Crane. And we are going to then save the rest of our moolah for later, where we will do a last day thing and try to do last day luck. Our last day luck on a lot of these banners has stunk. Lately, stunk to the highest of heavens, uh, but we will see what happens. Um, okay, we know she's got an event bonus. There she is. And we're going to try to pad our bets by um, doing this in, in little spurts. Let's see if we get lucky with a double or triple. She thinks she's God's gift to women. To make her an interesting character. <laughs> yes, I do wish, guys, that I'd been able to get a um, get the super success using more of those. But we're just going to use up the rest of them now since we already have what we want. <laughs> that raised her up pretty quick, guys. Alrighty, so mm. this uh, our our. Our whatever you want to call it, guys, at this point, our, uh, I, w I keep thinking preliminary, but that's not what I'm thinking of. Our pre-ritual, there we go, 
has worked out really well in multiple ways tonight, guys. Let's see if we can continue on with that trend, even though people have been having this poor luck. They've been having absolutely abysmal luck, I think I've heard, getting Miss Crane. Um, and now that I've done a lot of stuff, I really don't need the character even. It's more of a just, you know, hey, I'd like to have her for having me. Um, she's not a bad character, but really she shines the most during this event. I saw that pause. Is it going to be good? It is not. Though I said that. Ah, that's because she's rated up too. I forgot. I forgot. Uh, I think that was another pause. Event TV. Okay. I'm going to have so many things to do, guys, later on. Uh, that's another pause. I'm going to have so many things. i got to blend so many cards. Oh, I have way too many. Just way too many um, CE right now. I will not be able to do another quest until I blend a bunch of stuff together. Oh, that's interesting. It seems like we have a couple of little pauses in here. That is a fake pause. You do get those every once in a while. This roll, guys, is not looking anywhere near as good as the other stuff. And I think I have a very high suspicion why. But none of the other banners coming up in the future, guys, even remotely interest me. So I don't have a huge problem using uh, the remaining St. Quartz in a couple days trying to do a final, final roll on this banner. Because I think because the banners that have been coming up lately, guys, are absolutely crap in my opinion. But that's just my opinion. I couldn't even remember if we got a four star. That was terrible. We got one. Look at the difference in the banners, guys. We did the same amount of stuff that we usually do. And we ended up with this banner only getting one stinking craft essence. Um, I am going to do... I don't have much else to do with tickets, guys. So let's do a couple tickets. It's not going to be exactly a key to Sean, but let's see if we get any luck. Um, and if nothing else, I think I will do one more roll tonight after we do some of the stuff with the tickets we have well there's a caster yeah unless it flashed it was and we also have to always be careful because i think that nito chris is still active in here and we could get a hardcore not really spook but you know not what we want by any stretch of the imagination so like i said we're one ticket shy of actually doing a um actually doing a um Kita Sean Ritual, guys, which almost never does me good, but we will do it because I just did not like that. I do not want to end the night on such a sour note. It is a four star um, because we have done so spectacular, and I just feel like, hey, and we get a times two for doing this one. All right, so not bad. Um, I would like to end it on some kind of positive note, and either that I'm positive that I'm getting screwed or that uh, positive is in yippee we're doing great you know that kind of positive um however i don't think it's going to come from our ticket rolls that's for sure all right so let's see guys not doing anything special let's go for it let's um back out this will leave us well let's just say we'll be fine when if we don't get what we want from this we will be fine coming back in a few days and doing the last. I think they, I don't know why, I don't think this character is too particularly special, but it seems based on a lot of the videos I've seen that they are just keeping people from really getting this character without having to really spend out the nose. That is our guarantee fourth star, so take it as you will. Saw that pause. Had a hunch it was a servant. And kick to the old nutsack. Punt! I thought I, I thought I saw a pause. Yeah, I thought it was going to give us something, all right. But I expected event related.
Oh, come on. If nothing else, give me a break here, game, for efficiency sake. Let me have this last servant so I don't have to come back and make anything for a bit for a video. Not that I don't like making videos for you guys, but, yeah, you know, if I can spend some time doing some other stuff, I'd rather do that. Love to get her on a spook. I mean, not a spook, uh, crackle card. Excuse me, guys. Lots of casters in here, but not the one we want. Looking for that ever-loving gold. Oh, we're going to get crackled, but we're going to get nailed. What are we going to get? I could have could have gotten worse. Wow, double. Come on, come on. Get the right caster first off. Okay, caster. We're going to get the right one. No, of course we're not. That's it. He is down. He has been checked in the gut first a kick to the crotch then a nice gut check boom he is on the ground sucking dirt and i think that's all we're gonna do we are on a little bit of a parade here guys four star parade going on but um i do not think we're going to get a five star anything could be wrong but i don't think it's going to happen still back to back Servant summons, not bad, folks. Uh, let's go to the highlight reel where he took that wonderful gut check right after that wonderful nut crack, if you catch my drift. Um, yeah, the, the game double whammied me on that one. Two basic, what, well, spook, and then uh, basically a big kiss my butt. Uh, still, we did not end on a bad note, now did we, folks? So I definitely got yeah. what I wanted in a manner of speaking. Okay. So let's take a look, guys, at what we're going to be doing here. That will give us five of five. So whoop, whoop, not bad. So she is maxed out from here on in. She Anything else we get will be a wonderful rare prism for the collection. Next up, uh, this one, guys, is going to put us at four of five. So we have almost got into the point where he is almost in the same boat. And it's nice, guys. It shows that I've been playing the game for a really long time and I've been spending way too much money. <laughs> uh, um, that is not bad. How far are we over? Um, actually, how far? Come on. How bad? 23 cards over. Dang. I'm going to be busy, guys. Um, I wish I could say I was going to um, do another, like, you know, if... If I was going to blend cards, I should do it now. And if we get another super or great success, we can try another pull. But I am going to leave it at mm. that, folks, and leave us with um, not a bad evening. Not a bad evening. We got the meb we wanted, guys. We just still can't pull for Crane. Um, I think everybody else is having the same luck as me. Jeez, what a surprise. It's almost like the banner is rigged. No. That can't be. Look, at, you guys can't see me, but my face is totally deadpan right here. No, no, that can't possibly be true. Gaming companies don't rig things in their favor, just like casinos don't make it so that the house always wins. No, that never happens. The la 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 la. How, how dare, how dare you voice from beyond say such cruel and unscrutable things. Yeah, right. Folks, thing is, is that sometimes we do good like the Meb thing we did, sometimes we do bad if you a lot of times notice we tend to have better luck as of lately when we're doing banners that are let's just say they're putting out servants that aren't so new and they tend to know that a lot of people probably aren't going to roll on them because they already have those servants so they tend to make the odds a little bit more in your favor that's just my theory but tends to be that if I looked at enough videos, I could probably put together a really good circumstantial case. So, um, thank you guys so much for checking this video out, whether you be on the Dark Comet Nerd channel, guys, or the Shattered Ray Shift channel. I am going to end it now, guys, at the what mark? Uh, about almost getting on the 35 minute mark, so not bad, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much, everybody. I hope you all enjoy your Friday, everybody. And now it is getting dang late and I am going to go to bed. Thank you so much, guys, for joining me. I know you'll be all watching this in the morning. So enjoy your Friday and enjoy your weekend, everybody.